In today's video, we're going to be talking about the top five HCF servers of 2021. And for clarification purposes, this is for the new generation of HCF. I'm not talking about HCF pre-2017. So if you guys want a tier list of those servers, get this video to 200 likes and maybe I'll make it happen. And hopefully not make you upset. So yeah, let's get started. Starting with number five, I know I said five servers, but I'm going to list these servers here. I hold all at the same level because I either don't know them, they're a Spanish server, or th they just suck. So we have these servers. We have Faithful, Fierce, Belt, and Holy HF. Holy HF owned by a Resucting, and it's my favorite of these four servers. Um, but it's still number five because I don't play Spanish community HF. So that's why it's here. But I love Resucting. Hi, Resucting. I know you're watching. So maybe it should be one number one, but... Uh, this is an English list. I'm gonna skip past this because I only include this in the top five because I know people are gonna complain that I didn't include these servers, despite the fact that I don't think I've ever played them like on HF. So I can't really give them a good a good opinion, anyways. Continuing to number four, we have Sage PVP, and the only reason I put this slightly above the fifth tier is because they're the only server that still is keeping a consistent player count, like above a hundred, even if it's spoofed. I don't know if they player spoof or not I, I know they used to so that might dock some points that they're also number four for a reason uh, but they at least have a consistent amount of players and I also used to be a media owner so bias exists also base rating on here sucks if you go at a base rate on sage you are a psychopath and you should be put out of your misery anyways uh, yes sage is a team fighting server so that's probably why base rating sucks anyways let's transition to numero five where we have shush MC and I know this is controversial, but let's be real. I didn't have another server to put at number three, and I think q and is a funny guy, and informing them are cooking up some heat. So um, maybe maybe it'll be good. Um, I've only ever played their kit map, and I did it on an alt. Uh, yeah, and it was it was all right. I'm going to put them at number three because they got potential, and they're really more suited for the team fighting community, not the base rating community. So not new generation of HF, more old gen, but... Hey, I still put them on here because I think it's good to have diversity. And now at number two, we have Cave PvP. And I might get yelled at from Viper for putting a competitor so high in my tier list. I'm, I'm just kidding. No one actually cares. For base rating, it's the first time I'm going to be talking really in depth about base rating. But my main reason for putting Cave at number two and not number one is just because of how stupidly easy it is to base rate on here, okay? I've been a partner on Cave before, and trust me when I tell you, it almost gets a little boring trying to base rate on here. I, I, I have trouble enjoying it sometimes. Now, I've been a partner on Cave before for a long time, and uh, trust me, I love the server, okay? I, I was with them for like three, four months almost, and I love Simply Trash. I love um, everyone there. I, I, I love Headed. Headed, if you're watching this video, I, I love you. Not in that way, unless you want it to be in that way. Anyways, base rating is a skill you got to practice on every other server. You know, you got to kind of transition into it, and Cave just kind of hands that to you on a silver platter. Oh, you've never run into a base before? Don't worry. Just right-click your Ender Pearl, and you're in a one-by-one one with them. That, that's how I feel about Cave. And that's also one of my main reasons for leaving Cave. I never made a video fully addressing that, but, I mean, mostly because I felt my content was getting kind of boring when I made it on there. Also, the economy is busted, okay? You can literally get a dub of each partner item for, like, a bag of chips. Anyways, for number one, it's obviously going to be Viper. For HCF, new generation, base rating, and garbage and stuff, I, I, I'm i just saying it's, it's obviously going to be Viper. Was that not obvious? I'm partnered here, okay? And if we even forget that for a second, if we go back like a month ago, I still would have made this video and put Viper at number one. If I was still famous rank, not being paid, I don't even, I'm not even being paid for this video because it's not even a Viper video. I just made this video because it's a general video for the topic of HCF, so why not? Uh, now I put this server at number one just because of how attached to this community I am and how much I love the grind aspect to base running, okay? I think when base running is kind of just easy and stupid, I, I, it's stupid. Exactly. Now, base running is very, it's, it's very hard on Viper, okay? Because of how advanced the trappers are getting, which kind of sucks. It's not a very friendly place to get started with, but once you get the skill, you know, once you practice it, harness your ability to run into base and make people raid ball, it, it, it's a lot of fun. It's, it's very rewarding to make someone raidable on Viper. It feels like you worked for something rather than if you just did it on a uh, cave or sage where it's 
either too easy, unbalanced, or whatever. I think Viper has a great balance system apart from the samurai ability, okay? Trappers, I know your pain. Someone samurai ability into a one by one with me and made me raidable before. It's not fun. <laughs> so anyways, I, I agree. There's some parts of Viper that do need changing and for trapping, it it's a little mean. But overall, I think Viper is number one for many reasons. Of course, obviously the highest player count is going to be the biggest factor. And another thing is that they have caster keys, which automatically make them really cool. By the way, if you do play Viper, um, you should definitely consider using such redeem caster and the code caster anytime you visit their store. Only reason being is because it gives you a massive, massive glizzy okay first time ever using that term also um I i'm talking about the hot dog you know like in the buns okay not not the other thing you know don't be inappropriate on me anyways uh, this video has gone on too long it's literally just a top 10 list or top 5 list i would have done a top 10 list by the way but there isn't that many servers to do a top 10 list on not without going to the Spanish community, there isn't, and I don't know anything about the Spanish community, and that would be very unfair if I made a video judging the Spanish community HCF without playing it, so I'm not going to bother. But anyways, if you guys did enjoy today's video, and you guys want to be cool, then just be cool. That's it. Hit the subscribe button. That is the cool button. It is the self-proclaimed cool button. Also, majority of people aren't subscribed. For whatever reason, that is a huge mistake on your guys' end, and I expect you guys to fix it. Anyways, love you guys all. Peace out.